Okay, so really quick before I start, but in my inventory for 2017, I didn't break up my makeup in different sections. I kind of clumped palettes all together um, with like, you know, like my blush palettes together with my single blushes and things like that. And I don't even think I had a category for palettes, um, for powder, for powders and palettes. So I didn't even, I didn't even think about that. So, uh, but in, in 2017, I'm sorry, I'm trying to get all my thoughts together. In 2017, I only had this palette, um, for powders and it's, I have bronzers in here too. Uh, so I just had these two along with my single powders. Um, and then this one is new. And this one is the Kat Von D Shade and Light palette. And I have three right here. So all together I have five powders because this one is a highlight. Um, I have five powders in palettes. So I hope that makes sense what I said. It it makes sense in my mind, but I don't know. I hope I made I hope it made sense to you guys. But yeah, I didn't even have a category. I forgot about this category, but yeah. So my numbers may look a little bit different um, when I put them down, be down below at the bottom here um, because I, I kind of put all the palettes along with um, different categories. Anyway, if it doesn't make sense to you, just <laughs> comment down below. <laughs> all right, so I have all that to say I have five powders in palettes. Okay, so this is my all my highlighters in my collection. In my last inventory, I had 11. I think in the picture I had 10, but I forgot to put this one in right here. So in the picture, you only see 10. So let's go ahead and get started with this one. This one is the Kevin Aquan in, um, ugh, dug my hand in my, my nail in there. Um, this one is in Candlelight, and this is in one of my projects. Uh, this one right here is from Wet n Wild, the Precious Pearls. This one is the Becca Highlight in um, Opal. That's a mini one. This one is a physician's, ugh, excuse me, the Physician's Formula one. This is Wet n Wild Fergie in um, Hollywood Boulevard so this was an this one is an older one it's not in the new packaging and I think this one doesn't have a name I think this is like I don't know I forgot to tell you um I don't know I think it's in the new it's the lightest one this one is an Ofra one and this one is in you do you this one is in one of my projects this is the Betty not the Betty I always say that the Mary Luminizer and I had to repress it. This is in one of my projects. I had to repress this. Um, there's still a ton of product in here, but yeah. Um, this one right here is um, the uh, It Cosmetics CC uh, Radiance Ombre Bronzer and up here this is all highlight. So, and down here is the bronzer, so I still count this in as um, highlight. And then this last one right here is from uh, Laura Mercier. This is the famous um, 01 highlighter. So, so right here, I don't know if I said that, but I have nine highlighters in my collection, single highlighters, and then we're gonna move into the palettes. So I'm down to, um, yeah, I got, I used up two last time and I, no, actually no, I used up three. Um, and now I'm down to um, nine, so that's pretty good, but I'm trying to get these numbers a little bit down, so I'm trying to use this one up and this one up too. So, let me move on. These are all my highlighters and palettes, and this number has definitely grown. I think I only had this palette, this palette, and that palette last time. Um, no, actually, you know what, that's not true. These four I had, and these two are new. So I have 12 highlighters 
um, in this section in palettes. So this one's from The Bomb, and I believe this one is Betty Luminizer. Um, this one right here is from this palette from Tarte. Oh, this is the Showstopper palette. And this is a highlighter that I will, sorry, this is a highlighter that I will never use. It's really, it doesn't look good on my skin tone, but regardless, there's a highlighter in here. These are the ones that are new right here. This is the um, Sleek palette, and this is in Solstice. And let me see, I have four highlighters in here. This is brand new. This was given to me by my friend from Norway. So these are four highlighters right here. This one is from the from Maybelline, um, the Master Bronze. And this, I keep digging my nails in this, in these palettes, but this one right here is a highlight. So everything else is not, but this one is, although this one could be, yeah, I guess that could be a highlight, but I don't know. I counted it, a, I counted it as a bronzer, but yeah. And then this one right here, this is from the Anastasia Contour Kit. Um, this one right here is a highlight. And then this last one right here is from the um, Carly Bible Palette. And I have four highlighters here, even though that's really dark for me. But yeah, they're still considered highlights. So yeah, I've um, increased this number by these two palettes. Um, but I have 12 highlights in palettes. Okay, so these are my single bronzers. And my last inventory, I had nine bronzers. I used up two and then I decluttered one. Um, so right now I have seven and let's just go over them. So this one is the NARS. This one is called Tahiti, but honestly, I really think it's a Laguna bronzer. Um, yeah, there's not a lot of, uh, product in here and the pan is really shallow. So I'm really trying to finish this one up this year. This one is the It Cosmetics. Um, this is the Ombre the CC Radiance Ombre Bronzer. I haven't touched that this year, but I was working on that last year. Um, this is the Happy Booster from Physicians Formula. I'm not gonna open up that. I'm not gonna open that up right now, but I am using it. I kind of crushed the hearts, and I've been using that. This is the Mac and Give Me Sun. This one right here is the Body Shop. Uh, bronzer in 04. This one is the Laura Geller bronzer. And this one is in Sunset Sunset Deep. And this last one here is from Kevin Aquan. And this one is in the Celestial Bronzing Veil in Tropical Nights. So, yeah seven single bronzers okay and i have one cream bronzer this is in la Ritzy. i got this from my friend um from norway so this is what it looks like yeah i've never heard of this brand i think she got this in a glossy box and she hand she passed it on to me because this is this was a little bit darker for her skin tone so yeah, I just have one bronzer, and I actually really like this bronzer. Really um, like the way it blends, so. Okay, so these are the bronzers and palettes. So I have three in the Anastasia Contour Kit right here. And then this is from, this is a Maybelline Master Bronze palette. And I have three right here. This is a highlight. And then this is from the Shade and Light palette from Kat Von D. And these are three bronzers as well. So all together there is nine. Nine bronzers that I have in palettes. Okay, so here is my blush collection. Yeah, my name is Betsy and I am a blush hoarder. 
I have a problem, as you can see. I have 47 blushes, single blushes, and this number did go up, so I do not need to be buying any more blushes. I don't need any more in my collection. This is going to last me until I'm 190, so yeah, <laughs> I don't need any more, um, and this is a temptation for me to buy, so I need to stop. 47 blushes is enough and I still have more so um, in palettes so I need to kind of stop and I have I've been doing good so far so anyway let me go through this I kind of section them out into brands I'm not gonna go through blushes individual blushes because this is gonna take forever if you would like to see a you know, a uh, collection, a blush collection video, I would be more than happy to do that. I love blushes. So let me know down below and I will do that for you. But for now, I'm just going to kind of go through them in sections. Okay, so this is all MAC blushes. And as you can see here, this one cracked. I had no idea. So I have to, I need to be careful. That one is in, I'll tell you that one. That one's in Sun Basque, I think. So yeah, those are depotted and these are in the, still in their pots. So those are my MAC blushes, which I absolutely love. Moving on over here, these two are Tarte blushes. These three right here are the Bomb blushes. These three right here are all Milani blushes. These two are NYX blushes. Moving on to Benefit blushes. Two from Milani. Actually, no, I'm sorry. <laughs> Five from Milani, but these are in the flower, pretty flower um, packaging. One from Too Faced. And I actually finished one up last year that was in Baby Love. So this is the only one I have left. Those lovely three over here are from Becca. These two, and I did finish one last year as well. Um, these two are NARS blushes. This loner over here, which is actually beautiful, is from Sleek that I got from my friend from Norway. This one over here is um, from Maybelline. And yeah, it's more of a highlight than it is a blush. And actually, let me put this one right here because this is also Maybelline as well. This is another Maybelline highlight, more of a cool tone pink blush. This one right here, which I absolutely love. Um, this is from Wet n Wild. This, these are all kind of loners. Um, this one is from Elamasca. This one right here, I'm sure you recognize, which I'm not gonna open. This is in my a couple a couple of projects um, and I'm trying to finish up this blush but this is the elf contouring blush and bronzer I finished up the bronzer but I still do have the blush and I'm trying to finish that up for this year this lovely one right here is um, from Urban Decay this one is from Essence uh, this one is this is makeup no amazing cosmetics this one is from Clinique yeah and it's the cheek pop and let's see this is oops from it cosmetics these three right here are from cargo cosmetics this one is from Jue, Jue, Jue. I don't know. I love this packaging. These two are W7 that I got from a friend of mine as well. So these two. And then let's see. Did I talk about this one? Laura Geller blush. And then this last one is a physician's formula blush which I actually depotted it's in another Z pot so 
yeah, but this is the packaging. But yes, I do need to work on my blushes and I can definitely see why some people think this is really humbling when they have a section that's so big. So this is one of my biggest sections along with palettes. But yes, that's what I have for single blushes. Okay, for cream blushes, I only have one. This is from MUA and this is in the color Frolic. So it's two different shades. Let me show you. So that's what it looks like right there. And I got this from my friend also from Norway. Okay, so these are all blushes and palettes. Okay, so this blush right here is from the Showstopper, I believe, from Tarte. Yes, from Tarte. And I don't know the name of this blush, but yes, there's a blush right here. This as well is also from Tarte. This is the Pin Up Girl palette. So I have five blushes here. And then this right here is from Juvia's Place. This is the Saharan Blush Volume 2. And I have six blushes right here. Well, actually, this could be a highlighter. But, you know, I'm counting it in as a blush. Because it can be a blush topper or a highlighter. And then this blush right here is from the Bon Jovi palette from the Balm. I'm sure you all have seen this. Um, but yeah, that's a blush right there. And I believe this is Frat Boy. So I do have Frat Boy in a single. So I have two. Yeah, what to do with all this blush. But yeah, that's pretty much the same thing. So yeah. So how many do I have here? Let's see. Six. 11, 12, no, 13, I'm sorry, I can't count. But yeah, so I have 13 blushes right here. So I need to add that on to my collection along with the cream one, so, yep. Okay, so these are my lipsticks and tubes, and I had no idea that I had cut this number in half. I have 20 lipsticks here. And the last inventory I had, I had 41 lipsticks in tubes. So this number has gone down tremendously and I'm so proud of myself because I have been working so hard to get this number down because I have so many old lipsticks. So <clears throat> let me just run through them really quick, okay? So I'm just gonna, because this is a lot, so um, these four are MAC lipsticks, obviously. These two are CoverGirl, two from NARS. These three right here are from Milani. These two are from Wet n Wild. This one right here is a MUA. This one is a Kat Von D lipstick. This one is a Lorac lipstick. <clears throat> this one is a flower lipstick, a L'Oreal lipstick, NARS lipstick, and finally um, a Maybelline lipstick. So a lot of these lipsticks are old, so I'm really trying to bring my numbers down and I'm really, I've been really impressed because this number was doubled um, two years ago. So really, really proud. And I'm hoping to finish about, I don't know, 13 lipsticks this go around too. We'll see. But last year, I think I finished 10. So I think I can probably cut this number in half again. So we'll see. But that's really exciting for me because I've been working on this section. I haven't, I've been trying not to buy lipsticks because lipsticks are a weakness of mine, but I'm trying not to buy any, but yeah. These are my liquid lipsticks. So last inventory I had 16 and now I have 15. Um, with all my lips, my, with all my lip products, I have either decluttered them or um, I have gone through them. Um, I had to declutter, I, I haven't uh, finished up any liquid lipsticks um, in the last two years. I've just gotten rid of some, so, but 
Um, yeah, last time I had 16 and now I have 15, but I need to work on a couple of these. Um, and I am working on one of these. So anyway, let me go through them. So this is these three are bare minerals. Stila, Sephora, Ofra, Smashbox, uh, Dose of Colors, NYX, Jordana, Galactic, um, Tarte, and Kat Von D. So I'm sorry I can't go through all the names of them because I have so many. I'm hoping in the next year, if I have less, I'll be able to go through all the names. But let me know if you want to, um, for all the categories, the big categories that I haven't, um, m you know, mentioned the name, let me know if you want to see uh, like a lipstick collection. Or, um, yeah, let me know if you want to see like a lipstick collection or blush collection or a palette collection. I can definitely do that for you. Okay, so these do need to be added in that in that pile as well. These are two um, lipsticks that are in tubes. So I, last time I had three and I decluttered one, so I have two here. These both are from Too Faced and I can mention the names real quick. This is in Melted Chihuahua and Melted Peony. These are my chubby sticks. So last inventory I had nine and now I have five. So these are my older ones. This is Revlon in um, Sultry. This one is um, Elf's Tea Rose. The Lilac from L'Oreal. And I think this is, um, I can't read this, Never Lacking. I think that's what it says. The print is so small. This is one that I got from my friend. This is from Isadora. And does it have a name? Lovely Lavender. And this last one right here is from Honest Beauty. And this one is, oops, in Marsala Kiss. So I have five now, which is not bad at all. I had no idea until I went through this inventory that I had finished, uh, let's see, four. Or I and I think I decluttered one or two or something like that. So, so through using them up and declutters, I was able to, you know, have five now. So, for lip liners, I managed to finish up my last lip liner. Woo! So that update will be coming up soon. But I only have one lip liner now, and this is a clear one, and this is. The Remmel Universal lip liner. So this is the only thing I wanted to have in my collection because I don't use lip liners and I want it like a clear one. So I bought this one. So I'm very happy to have this and I'm so glad that I only that I got rid of all my lip liners and excited that I just have this clear one. Okay, so I am super proud of this number. And Right now, I have only one lip gloss, and this is from Lorac, and it's in Secret Agent. When I first started my channel, I had 40 lip glosses, and I don't know how I got 40 lip glosses because I do not like lip glosses at all. So I wanted to get that number down so bad, and as you can see, with Project Panning, I've been able to do that and I'm down to one. Last inventory, I believe I had seven lip glosses and now I'm down to one. I am using this throughout the whole year because you know I only have one so I don't have to use it every day. Um, so I'm allowing myself to, you know, to use it up for a year. But I am so proud of this. So project panning does work, guys. <laughs> It really does. 40 down to one. It took me, what, four years? How many years have I been doing? Since 2015. So, yeah, I went in 2019. So, yeah. 
project panning does work. For lip balms, I have just two. I have this Blistic Complete Moisture, and, and this is brand new, and then this Chapstick in Cherry, Classic Cherry. And right now I'm trying to use this one up. Uh, my last inventory, I had four lip balms and two treatments. I finished up the treatments and um, I finished up two more lip balms, so I'm left with just two.